back to the past to play the shitty games and suck ass. He'd rather have a buffalo. Were you expecting uh, maybe uh, the Ninja Turtles? <laughs> well, we're gonna play some Fester's Quest, and this is gonna get ugly. So there's Uncle fucking Fester minding his own business, sitting outside. Then aliens come down, and, well, that's the plot of the game. Fester's gotta save the world from aliens. If it happened to the Simpsons, why not the Addams Family? Makes as much sense as Tim Allen fighting dinosaurs. Yeah. So anyway, I'm just shooting these purple jellyfish things on the ground. What's the point? They don't hurt you unless you deliberately walk into them. And why is part of my body disappearing? Anyway, they leave behind items, but why couldn't they just have the items lying on the ground rather than having to blast your way through this shit? Sometimes there's a bunch of them, like, stacked together in one spot. It takes fucking forever and makes my fingers tired. It's just another gimmick to make you buy a turbo controller. So, I just picked up a better gun. It does a little more damage to the enemies, but it seems to dodge your targets. It just goes back and forth. And if it touches anything, it stops. Now look at this. I just want to shoot this fuckface. God damn! Oh, and these sewer parts? This is where the game really starts to take it in the fucking ass. It basically makes your gun useless. And these green blob things? Fuck them to hell. Instead of conveniently dying when you shoot them, they just multiply. Come on, you fucking pieces of shit! What the hell did I do? I got my old gun back? That's nice that it shoots straight, but it's not gonna help with killing these things. Switching back to the older gun would actually be a nice feature, but not when you accidentally step on an item that downgrades your weapon. Come on, die! Die! Jesus! They just keep multiplying. Without the dynamite, there's no way to get through these things. I have to keep walking back, and let's not forget one thing. Look at your life bar. That's full life. I'm not kidding. Some life bar, huh? If you get hit twice, you're dead. Come on, you fucking pieces of shit! You're still multiplying! They don't die. They don't die. Die, you fucking frogs! Jeez, can Fester move any slower? Ugh. Yes, he can. If he gets hit by frog spit, that is. Oh, shit. Come on. Oh, no. Oh, Jesus Christ! You fuckers! Might as well continue. What? Continue my ass! This doesn't look like continuing. You got the same weapon and items, though. Whoopity fucking do. But you start back at the beginning of the game. I can't cross where the hole is, which means I gotta go all the way back through the sewers all over again and deal with those green blobs again. God damn! This game better stop sucking ass or else I'm gonna have to give it the finger. The middle finger. Hate these frogs. This gun is useless. It just circles around everything. Look at that. It went completely around that frog and it didn't even hit him. I can't even shoot because the house and trees are in the way. I can't use the gun. I am so fucking dead. So fucking dead. Oh my god, if I could just get past this one guy. Ah, oh, shit! Alright, let's try it again, but with the dynamite. It sucks to have to waste this shit, but it'll have to do. Oh, when are they gonna stop? When are they gonna stop? When are they fucking gonna stop? Oh my god. Oh, fuck. Come on. Alright. Oh shit, what, two more? Where'd they come from? What the fuck? What the fuck, man? What the fuck? Jesus. Holy shit. Well, I'm back at the beginning. Again. Oh, why'd you have to do that? I downgraded the gun again. I think it's a shitload of fuck. I think you better shut your ass. Jesus Christ. God. Come on. I just want to get down there. Jeez, could 
Is there enough fucking frogs? Look, I downgraded the gun again. All right, I'm gonna go in that house there. If I can fucking make it. All right, now we're gonna use a key to open the door. Oh, nice. Beautiful. It's one of those half-ass first-person sort of deals. In the 8-bit era, it was kind of cool to see anything that looked three-dimensional, but it's a fucking pile of steaming goat shit. There's a door. Is it the one I came in? Well, let's see. Oh, it is. But for whatever reason, it takes you to the back. We want to go back in. You're kidding me. I, I gotta use another key? What is the door? Eat the key or something? These mazes are such fucking shit. I don't know where I'm going. Couldn't they have made any parts of it look different or decorate the walls? Have something to help identify where you are? Wait, what's the point of this anyway? Are there enemies to fight? No. Is there a time limit? No. Are there any items to get? No, except I've come across one power-up. But really, is there any good reason to have this maze thing? It sucks anus. Then you come up to this crazy alien guy. He's actually not that hard, because there's plenty of room to fight him for one thing, but he sure takes a lot of hits. Well, I beat the game. That's the last guy. It's over. That's just the first boss. It's the last guy. It's not. I know, but let's just say that it is, because that's all I can take. Well, we might have cleaned our hands that monstrosity, but there's a ton of other Adams Family related games, and I'm willing to bet that many of them suck just as hard. Here's one I happen to have, which I'm just going to throw in here for a bonus. The Adams Family on the Sega Genesis. So you play as Gomez, just walking around, regular side scroller. Oh shit, it's a ghost! Oh my fucking god. And then there's like monster broccoli, zombies, monkeys in spinning teacups, and a ton of weird, unnameable things. So you're just going around, jumping on things, collecting dollar symbols, then there's a letter A. I, I don't really know what it does. The game's not too hard, but it's easy to die, if that makes any sense. And this is due to two fatal flaws. One, the control is too sensitive. You just slide all over the place. And the other thing is that you have to be completely accurate to jump on your enemies. Look at this, I jump on both these guys, one of them dies, and the other one kills me. Like in Fester's Quest, at the start of the game, you only have two units of life. So if you're like me, you're gonna die, and die, and die, and die. Alright, let's try harder. No fucking around. Watch out for the penguins. Alright, we're just gonna... Yep, here we go. Yep, just keep on jumping. I don't even care if I kill them, just wanna get through them. Alright, oh, here we go, oh, oh, ooh, I got lucky there, I think. Alright, just keep jumping the peng... Ah, but I jumped on them, what are you kidding me? Man, fuck this game. This game is ass. It's crappy and it's kooky, a stupid piece of poopy. I'd rather eat my dookie, it makes me wanna pee. Sucking some ass, fuck. Sucking some balls, fuck. Sucking some balls, sucking some balls, sucking some ass, fuck. Makes me wanna see ya, a load of diarrhea. It's worse than gonorrhea. I'm gonna take that pee.